The Perks of Being a Wallflower was filmed right here in Pittsburgh and it comes out in theaters today. Well, we have a special treat for you. The writer and director of the movie who also wrote the book and is from Pittsburgh is in the studio today to talk about the movie. It's about a young boy who enters high school. It's about his freshman year. And he starts off, the, the story is a wallflower. He's very shy, doesn't have a lot of friends. He's really trying to make his way. But through the course of the story, he has every first you could think of. I mean, that first kiss and that first crush and that perfect driver, that perfect song, oh, and the friends, the friends who kind of get him all through it. You know, it's that. It's, I, guess, I guess the best way to say is like, what, what my generation, what The Breakfast Club meant to me or Dead Poets Society, it's, it's that kind of a movie. The film is based on Stephen's best-selling novel. What inspired him to write it? I was going through a tough time and, and like a lot of things, you need in those moments, you need hope. And uh, Charlie provided my hope. I'd say it that way. Um, and he was my answer to the question of why do such really great people let themselves get treated badly? We all know them, they're our friends, and we want better for them. And so this was my answer to that. More than 10 years later, Stephen, who grew up in Upper St. Clair, decided to shoot this special film at his favorite Pittsburgh spots. Here are the greatest hits. <laughs> the Fort Pitt Tunnel, of course. You know, and anyone that was stuck in the traffic jam, I'm very sorry, but it's so worth it. We shot there, we shot the Hollywood Theater in Dormont. That's where we shot the Rocky Horror Picture Show scenes. We shot all over Upper St. Clair. We shot in Peters Township High School. And yeah, those are, oh, and who could forget King's Family Restaurant. Steven says the film's stars, including Logan Lerman, Emma Watson, and Kate Walsh enjoyed filming in Pittsburgh. Kate Walsh, for example, obsessed with the uh, Sarah's chocolate pretzels, etc. And um, yeah, they loved it. The producers raved about the Berg as well. My producers, you know, they produce a lot of movies for Jason Reitman, they produced Juno, and uh, they were blown away by the crews here. You know, and, and, and we have a really deep bench here in Pittsburgh. And so you're only going to get more productions from that. Steven has become a big name in Hollywood. He co-created a TV series and wrote the screenplay it's for the film like Rent based, really based on the Rent. Jonathan Larson I, musical. I, the night of the premiere of Rent at the Ziegfeld Theater in New York City, it was over and, and you know, all the cameras go away and you sit left with a message. And mine was, you know, Larson did his thing. This was his thing. I helped. But it's his, it's not mine, it's his. And I thought about what's mine gonna be? What's that thing? And now I did it. And, it's and, it, perks. Yeah, and it's perks. And, and, it's, uh, and it really came a lot from that night. For WPXI.com, I'm Carly Noel.